Hi boys and girls. Today for math, we are going to compare quantities. I have a question for you. I want you to think. Would you rather have more of a Hershey bar or would you rather have more Sour Patch Kids? Hmm. Which one would you rather have more of if you could only pick one? Go ahead and tell me. Ah, oh, guess what Mrs. Bikey would pick? She would pick a Hershey bar. She would want more chocolate than Sour Patch Kids. So today we're gonna compare quantities and numbers by using some big math words. We're gonna be mathematicians today. We're gonna be using words like more, which means bigger, greater. There are more stars in this group than in this group. We're gonna be using words like equal. If you look at the stars in this group and the stars in this group, they're the same amount of stars. They're equal amount. There are four stars in this group and four stars in that group. They are equal the same. And we're going to be using words like less. If you look at this group, there are four stars. This group, there are two stars. So there are less stars in this group so we're going to be using words like more, equal, and less. Okay, Mrs. Bikey is going to put some dinosaurs into her two groups. I have group one and group two. And your job is to decide which group has more dinosaurs. Just like on our chart, we have more stars in this group than in that group. So which one has more stars? That means greater. Hmm. If you want, you can close your eyes. Okay, here we go. In group one, Mrs. Spikey has that many dinosaurs. You can keep your eyes closed still. In group two, I have that many. Okay, if you close your eyes, open them up. All right, we have two groups of dinosaurs. And the question is, which group has more dinosaurs? Well, first, I got to get my counting finger out and count. How many dinosaurs are in this group? Let's count. One, two, three, four. There are four dinosaurs. How many dinosaurs are in this group? One, two. Which group has more dinosaurs? Four or two? Which number is bigger? You're right. This group with four dinosaurs has more. Okay, now we're going to see which group has less dinosaurs. That means a smaller number, less. There are four stars in this group and two stars in this group. So this group has less stars. That means a smaller number. So close your eyes. We're going to compare our dinosaurs. Okay, I want you to open your eyes. All right, the question is, which group has less, a smaller number of dinosaurs, less, smaller? Hmm, first, we have to count. In this group, I see one dinosaur. Let's count how many dinosaurs in this group. One, two, three, four, five. Which group is less? Which has a lesser amount of dinosaurs, smaller number? You're right, this group with one dinosaur. All right, close your eyes, one more. This time, Mrs. Becky's gonna compare blocks, not dinosaurs. Okay, so the question is, which group has more blocks, or is there a equal amount of blocks in the group? Okay, open your eyes. All right, we have two groups of blocks, and Mrs. Bikey wants to count them, and we have to compare them. So which group, does there a group that has more blocks, or are they equal amount? That means the same amount, the same number. Let's count first. One, two, three, four. There are four blocks in this group. How many in this group? One, two, three, four. Wait a minute, there are four four blocks in this group and four blocks in this group. That means they are the equal amount, the same amount. 
Just like there are four stars in this group and four stars in this group. They are equal the same amount. Great job, boys and girls. Okay, boys and girls, now what I want you to do is I want you to compare the number of shoes that your family members have. So you're gonna go around and you're going to count how many shoes each family member has. And then you're gonna decide who has more shoes, greatest amount, who has the less amount of shoes, which means the smaller number of shoes. And does anybody have the equal amount of shoes, the same amount of shoes? So that's what I want you to do. I want you to go around and compare the number of shoes that your family members have.